Thank you for tuning in to the Pointless Talks podcast. This episode is being brought to you as a part of the many things that Pointless creates. For our returning listeners, thank you so much for coming back. And if this is your first episode, welcome, get comfortable, and please keep an open mind. All right. And we're live. Good night, good night, good night, good night. Hello, all. Welcome back. You're cool? I'm chilling, nigga. Why are you, why are you stressing me out? I'm chilling. Mm. <laughs> stressing me out, bro. Like, I am good, man. I'm just, you know, I'm tough. I like to be tough. Like, it, it's, you know, mm. it, it's the cancer moon. Let it be. So I can <laughs> tell too, nigga. I'm under here with my blanket, so I can't say that. Exactly. Man. It's just but a little I'm, I'm always cold, though, so. It made me feel safe. Felt, felt, <laughs> felt. Um... <laughs> What's, so, what's, what's good? The Gaga, what's going on? What's going on? Well, everybody talking about these people and they are uh, Rico. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, boy. You play yeah, stupid it's, games. It's going down. That's what I say. You play stupid games, you win stupid prizes. I agree. That's that's literally all I got to say about it. If y'all ain't here, Young Thug and Gunna are... Um, them folks. Mm. All of them. Them and all their friends. Among 28 <laughs> defendants charging a 56 count indictment. Rico charge. 56. Rico charge, baby. Mm-mm, that's all a dog gone to. Uh huh. I don't really know what to say. I mean, it's, it's you know, you. <laughs> they don't just want to rap about it, they want to live it. So, yeah. I mean, and I feel like, okay, go you for being credible, but after mm-hmm. you get to a certain level, like, done the fuck right now? like no y'all just take the nigga out the street you can't take the street out of the nigga i guess like Maybe it's the same thing you can take the, the whore out the street what you can't well how it go the whole yeah. out the housewife whatever you call that shit <laughs> i like when they one in the same but that's just me i'm ashamed but <laughs> with all the hoe and just be a housewife well, yeah what? i need yeah. all of it everything. exactly i need all shades 50 mm. kind of shades whatever you know what i'm saying her thing but um, I really don't have nothing to say about that. It's just <laughs> no, I don't either. I really just, don't because it's like, it just, go ahead. You did it, <laughs> like basically. It's a tale as old as time. Mm-hmm. I'm sick Your of shit, it. Y'all, go, y'all shit gonna catch up to y'all. No matter what you say, no matter what you and do, know whatever it. you put out, it's gonna come back. Like I don't care how much money you got. I mean, you might get lucky. You might get a lesser charge because you're probably gonna snitch or whatever the hell's gonna happen. But that's the but... thing they're trying to say. Who they trying? Everybody's trying to on social media trying to figure out who gonna snitch, who gonna sing, who gonna this, who gonna that. Listen, <laughs> with Rico charges, baby, it's all about who can get the first to the table. Mm-hmm. Okay, and get and try to get a lesser sentence, like. Yeah, this is about to be some shit. This is how they used to get these friggin' mafia groups back in the day. Mm-hmm. Bringing sixty of them niggas and be like, "Who's and, singing uh, first? Yeah, who wants the better chance? Who mm-hmm. wants the lesser charges? Yeah, okay, you gonna find out who your niggas are today? Huh? Quick. Yeah, but, like, um, they were saying stuff about homeboy that's already in there too. They homie, what's his name? Lucci. Oh, see, I've... yeah, people was trying to point fingers at him and saying certain. Nah. Me, I don't know these folk. I don't know who's singing about who. I don't know who's niggas with who. I just, you, I don't know nothing about slimes that, and whatever they call themselves. Slimes, slime, mm-hmm. whatever the hell. I don't know. Um, Listen to that, their music, Young Thug. I like, um, but I know, as people say, he like really about that life. I don't have time. <laughs> you really want to be about that life? I, I don't. I don't. I, I can't name any of his songs. I probably know them, but I don't know Thug. them to associate them with him. Oh, That's man. just how. I at least know few, some of his songs. Years ago, at least a few years ago, you knew some Young Thug. Maybe not. No, I'm not saying I don't know them. I'm just saying I don't know them well enough to be like, oh, Young Thug sings that. Like you know what I'm saying? Like if I hear, it, I'd be like, oh, it's a nice song. Yeah, that's cool. Whatever. Yeah, but like, like, no, it's a nice song to no damn young. Thug. Like, oh, this that shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Remember this? Whatever. <laughs> 2014, 2015, around that time, right? Like twenty. That was that. Hey, like, yeah. Okay. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> I remember. Okay. I don't know who. I'm. I'm not saying I don't know the song. I'm just saying I can't tell you he sang it or if you'd be like oh name one of his songs i'm be like it really went up for me because i was in georgia at that time oh a lot of their songs was whatever whatever and yeah well, yeah he was busting around when fetty wap was doing his little run around and when mm-hmm. migos was migos in for real mm-hmm. not the new migos the old migos 
and shit like that. So okay. Um, <laughs> honey, them lawyers ain't getting no sleep. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, you see the foolishness Popcorn carrying on with? Um, the fact that he basically uh, what like disowned his brother because his brother was eating pussy or something like that. Yeah, did you see the video coming? If I see it, no, I don't want to see nobody. <laughs> kind of lingus, like I would hope. I'm just saying it hasn't graced my timeline. I ain't so. seen. It. I ain't seen it, and I probably wouldn't even watch it because I don't. I don't. You know what I'm saying? Like, what's the issue? I feel like he's stupid anyway. And everybody's trying to say, like, you be smoking with niggas who you know eat pussy out in the open. Like, you know this. But and it's your ass. Brother. Yeah, and ass. And it's your brother that you want to do this with? Like, how come I'm corny for that? But you look dumb as hell. You know, that shit as, you know how they be on that stupid shit? Mm-hmm. Like, what I got to do with you? Oh, I can't be associated. Mm, actually... Actually, you already are very much so. So your brother love Oman, so you can't be associated. What are we doing? There's I don't a lot know. of undercover <laughs> Batman foolishness be going this on. Is what I'm saying I don't understand. Like, all right, y'all saying yo Batman for that we don't like Batman, whatever, whatever. Any Batman listening, I don't mean to be rude or anything, but whatever. I don't like Batman. No. Batman is a tip of the endearment. <laughs> we take it. It's like endearment. We don't. We don't. You know, don't take no offense to it. Batman, mm-hmm. you like Batman, you like mine. It's Batman, it's fine. But my thing is, <laughs> <laughs> I don't want nobody to be offended. That's the only thing. But it's like it's such a hard line. You can be a Batman, but it's like you're saying you 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 are pleasuring your woman, and that's wrong too. Women aren't supposed to enjoy sex. You forgot that. What the hell am I supposed to do? But okay, so he okay with um, what you gonna call it then? When man, I get them hooked up after. Of course he is. I'm sure he is. I wouldn't be surprised if he is because. But then again, also somebody tweets to Andre. Um, yeah, I saw that. Them... <laughs> yeah, better better just stop talk, basically. Mm-hmm, because the woman when you fuck off mouth too, so I'm like, this is. You kind of the ones that be perfect. talking the most about not doing it be the ones that be naming out hell though, which is like everybody know that Jamaicans are easy. Yes, <laughs> like Basically. why? Who are you putting off for other men? I'm really trying to understand. I saw that last night too, and I was trying to understand. I was like, wait, you trying to help me? Like I had to go through like retweets and all this. Mm-hmm. Shit. Like, what are they talking about? And I really saw Popcorn really cut off his brother because his brother eat pussy. I I. He got to cut off everybody at this point yeah. and walk alone. Talk yeah. about unruly. Like, you're so silly. It's so immature. It's so sad. Yeah. It's um, so sad. Mm-mm. Like, of all the things in the world that people are doing, that's that's where you draw the line. I'm just, I'm, I didn't even know, like, grown people still think about shit like this. In big, big 2022. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know big people still think about shit like this. Who gives a damn? Like that's Jamaican people problem. Can't say why not other people bedroom. Fuckery. At all times. Oh, oh, oh. Sorry. Sorry. Oh, I'm tired. Whoa, whoa. Tired. Listen, Mercury retrograde has started. No. And uh, the fatigue. You're day the one. People. <laughs> Sorry. Damn. My, my oh. apologies, people. Damn. I'm I'm blaming Mercury retrograde because Oh, you one of them girls. Gotcha. <laughs> Speaking of being one of them girls, um No. Listen. No. We got like some candling on where they uh I look at money start running. So oh, I'll be one candle. of them girls. That's fine. <laughs> what candle is this now? The one I was a, a star candle? What is this? One look a success candle. One okay. look a money okay. candle. Okay. Oh, so like a money incense. Okay. And a couple manifestations and things and you know. Yes. I feel so that. I guess what I keep Whatever on. works. If the money comes, then it comes in. Then where keep the money reside, where the money reside, whatever. Let me stop. Oh, 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 oh. I'm trying to be. I'm trying to be. Never I reach that. yet. You know? I feel we, that. <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> Listen, I was low key. I, first of all, never have I ever, but I was I was on some some Ray and nephew bright and early Saturday morning, and ended up going grocery shopping. And you know the little um, Caribbean farmers market has like 
the aisle with all the incense and candles and all of that. Me yeah. find myself go down there. I'm going to pick up two candles, yeah? I'm going to mm-hmm. I was like, guys, don't I'm drink alcohol. The money candle, candle is green. Mm-hmm. Is it the one I got? Probably. Ah. But yours is like a smaller one. Mine is in a jar. I had big dog. It's no, I got the little one. Okay, big dog. I got the little one though, yeah, not the long. She, not there's the, the little one. Mine is. You're so aggy. A little, little bag. Wait a minute. Oh shit. <laughs> Whoa. Not even because there's a bunch of them. The one you had got was from the holistic store, but this. <laughs> you see why I can't sell it to black people? Anyways, <laughs> <laughs> they have the one that's like a three inch jar, and then it's like a. A twelve inch, like a the big the Which long Which jar you got? You got the twenty five inch jar or what? <laughs> no, oh, no, okay. I got the little three inch one because I was like, we don't see what happened. But speaking of little things, <laughs> I was about to be so rude. What I did on unboxing. <laughs> okay. I have a, this is TMI for some of y'all. If y'all sensitive to the topic of sex toys or whatever cover your ears at this point you shouldn't be on pointless stuff exactly you like stuff, like move but um uh, i did an unboxing was it last night last night because i've i've always wanted like a clear dildo like i've always been like they're so cool i want one i found one online for the low and i was like oh shit we lit man i opened that shit that thing's small i was so pissed i said that's what i get for talking about little dicks what do you call small <laughs> Um, okay, I shouldn't say it was small. It was just not as big as I thought it would be. What do you call small, friend? Like, okay. Okay, so put it in perspective. It's seven inches, but that includes the base and the ball. You must need a perspective. <laughs> Me. Uh oh. All right, now go. <laughs> 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 you a mess. It who that messaged me? Hold on there. Hold on. Um no, all holes oh, hell no. on D and D currently. No, because it's on my it's on my laptop. That's why I popped up as WhatsApp. But um so the description said it was like seven and change, right? Mm-hmm. But I didn't take into account that it was including the full length of the thing. Um, so that yeah, includes the, the suction from- base, the balls, and everything. Yeah, sometimes I was like, get, yeah, sometimes they get some people like that. So it was like really like four or five inches. That's how I like to go shopping for my dingalings in person. Yeah, yeah. I, prefer. I still haven't been to unless, a store here. Unless something I just said that the other day. Unless um, there's something I bought before and it proves to be mm-hmm. faithful, then mm-hmm. obviously I'm okay with pressing reorder. Yeah. But I usually, yeah, when it comes to my dicks, I like to go see about them. Like, I need them. Don't, touch don't them. have me order my, not telling y'all nothing. Um, <laughs> oh, you know, don't let me go to that section. I'm like, mm-hmm. I can't find that because I'm not getting things. I don't buy small dicks. You get the fuck on with yourself. Yeah. Don't. Stop playing. You and your five inches go to the left. Don't let me know them five inch dick, bro. I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> bro, I was like. Really? I opened a box and I was y'all gonna see the video when the unboxing drop. But I was just like the poor dildo probably pissed. That's me. it. Oh big hoe bitch. <laughs> <laughs> like put my ass back and send me back. Like what the fuck? I was like, I was really just like, but it looks so cool because it's like really clear. And I was like, oh man, it just, you know, a couple clear, of like just nothing. Yeah, just translucent. Yeah, just clear. Oh, okay. yeah. I, thought, I thought it was like one of them fun fetty joints. I was like, no, I want one of those too. I've been trying to find one. What are you doing? I want one. I have a glow in the dark one. Day, yo. Because it looks cool. Wow. Not necessarily to use it, just because it looks cool. I'm, I'm, you know what? I just like things my skin tones. I don't really play too many games. Yeah, I have one that's my skin tone. I ain't like, like when I was 14, 15, and had a purple one. Like, I ain't, I I got a glow in the dark one. (laughs) You a lot, you festive (laughs) because I don't, not glow in the dark. I don't know. Maybe, like, maybe like fun times, like hide and go dick kind of thing. (laughs) Bitch. That's the name of the episode. Hide that kind of go dick, like turn all the lights off in the house, put it on, and just run around. And you can see it. <laughs> like, that's fucking stupid. 
<laughs> you oh down my gosh. Bro, but you imagine like having mass space like outside? Yeah. I'm gonna find me a girlfriend so I could play hide and go dick. Hide and go dick, son. That mm-hmm. is a vibe. What? You see me running through the bushes. That's all you <laughs> this see. dick just swinging. You know, just... <laughs> Boy. Okay. Woo. If you catch oh. it, you can have it. Do what you Mm-mm. want. <laughs> Speak speaking of running. <clears throat> Wait, what? I said, speaking of running, what's um, going on? <laughs> y'all homegirl, what's her name? Shikari Richardson. Nah, uh, <laughs> miss, I'm pulling out the race. Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> Somebody said she didn't want to get beat again because Shelly Ann running. I was like, y'all are. Axe. <sighs> they can say, you like to smoke weed, but you don't like smoke. Bruh, I was dying. I was like, yo, why they keep tweeting about her and adding her in the tweets? Like, y'all are messy. Because Leave her it's alone. To your face, strictly to your face with yeah. this shit. You yeah. know they don't like her for real. They really don't. It's because she, you know how she did. No. She, she, no. she, she, uh, she kind of, I don't know. Like, it was fun to joke with her, but I actually, a part of me really wanted to see her, like, rise above or something. Yes. And actually be like, yo, F all that y'all talking. Even Shut if up. Joke and whatever. We know how Jamaicans joke. Mm-hmm. The thing with Jamaicans is Jamaicans can joke and at the bottom of it still want you to do as mm-hmm. best as you can. It's not even true hate. It's just like, mm-hmm. well, girl, you're losing a girl. And mm-hmm. you know who we are. And we'll joke for days about it. But at the end, we like, yo, we really want to see your rise up or whatever. Black woman, exactly. black woman type thing. Black people, black people, something. And just to know she's still like, girl, you Because honestly, if she came and she ran and she won, they would have definitely gave her all the healings. Well, they like, can just back her up. 100%. But because you're coming dead last and I don't want to risk where you didn't run. No, you and then... like, <laughs> thing when you talk too much, I can't, I can't do it. Oh, no, you like, have to you be able to. And you can't back it up. Mm. <laughs> Dead. That yeah, done. They, yeah, they over you, boy. You know? <laughs> like, damn, we talked all that shit, and then what? Like, yeah. Mm-mm. Yep. That shit, though. I'm like, she keep giving them like all the wrong reasons to talk about her. I don't Somebody was in the comments, the road, though. That's what I want to know. That's what I want to. After all of that, like, what's the problem? Girl. But four twenty had just passed too. Maybe couldn't run. What is that? I said four twenty had just passed. Maybe she couldn't uh-uh. run. Too. 420 just passed. Maybe she in those little bit. Huh. I'm just saying. I'm, mm-hmm. That's a thing, ain't it? Listen, I know she be burning too, but I, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, but if she's, like if she's trying to be a, a track, or whatever, she's going to have to tighten up. Mm-hmm. All these people that want to be. Well, wait, speaking of people who need to tighten up, where is that girl? Ooh. The one that they got over saw. Like, what's your name? Basketball player, what's your name? Oh, Brittany Reiner? Is that her yeah, name? She. she. Brittany somebody. Mm. I don't mean to see a name like that. But yeah, her. I don't know. I don't hear nothing about it since from uh, time. Let me I see. I don't know. I don't know. That no good night. I don't know. And let, I'm hearing less and less. Of it, and that's not cool. <laughs> like, mm. bring that girl home. Let me see. Is she still in Russia? Then talking about people don't say don't be like free her free her so they won't use her as a bargaining chip. Um, hello, mm. no finish. The war the war done, ain't it? I just want to be clear because we never know oh what's going on in this place. Let me see. Let me let me look it up while we on the internet. <laughs> yeah, cause we cause we skip from one tragedy to the next, and you never know what the fuck going on. Twenty twenty two Russian invasion of Ukraine. Fifty seven minutes ago, they still have live updates going on. See? Okay. Well, oh yeah, and it was just like, yeah, don't say too many free hers or bring too much attention to it because they don't want them to use her as a bargaining chip. Um. Oh wow! Yesterday was. If y'all don't bring um, this black woman child back home or something like that, listen, please. Time. Whatever the hell she is, she black, ain't she? Bring her ass back home. They ain't got black. nothing to do with us. <laughs> Please. It's been 75 days since Russia invaded Ukraine, and as the battle becomes a grinding war of attrition, Russia's president, oh, oh. Vladimir something, wait, name, what's keeping in? So apparently yesterday, May 9th, uh, marks the 77th anniversary of the victory over Nazi Germany in World War II. Oh, dare. <laughs> oh, gosh, what in the end, Frank, is going on? Oh, my Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, okay, sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what? Mm-hmm. Is she still? Let me see if it still shows up. 
Huh. Yeah, four days ago is still. Oh wow, she had luggage with vape cartridges with oil derived from cannabis. Yeah, girl, she That's had. What did the... entertain her for? A little yeah, THC. She had the oil. She had the little cartridge. You know how I'd be rocking with my cartridges, but she. I don't know what the hell. What these people be doing? Y'all don't need to be flying nowhere with nothing. If you don't, ne- you know what? Never mind. Don't do nothing illegal. Period. How about that? <laughs> First of all, internationally. <laughs> international you can find somebody who gonna give you some weed bruh like well i mean like i was saying to those who are gonna do what they're gonna do regardless like come on like i don't know my thing is where did you have that for them to find it in your hand luggage uh does it say where it was because there's no way that was in your suitcase no way um there's no way (laughs) It just says in her luggage. It didn't say. There's no way that was in her, da- bruh. In her actual suitcase. It just says luggage. I don't know. It doesn't it say be where. Luggage. I'm gonna say it has to be a hand luggage. I don't. I don't see it being in a suitcase. That would be too crazy. Like yeah, they were that they sick were to find that it. little piece of cartridge in your suitcase. Come on. Well, look at THC aisle. That's what I'm saying. I can't dash away anything at any time. Wrap up in anything. Don't listen to me. I'm just saying. <laughs> Yeah, we always talk about traveling and stuff and, like, being safe. But stuff like that, like, listen, I don't care what state you live in, if it's legal there. If you're going somewhere else and you don't know the laws of this place, like, better safe than sorry. Just don't carry it. Yes. Like, <clears throat> just, just don't carry it. Like <clears throat> My throat. Mm-mm. Yep, I agree, I think. But <laughs> you think people gonna do what they want to do? You feel me? So. They are, but my thing is like, you go risk bullshit like that when you more than likely. First of all, whatever. I think that's the, I think that's the fear, isn't it? That you'll go to this place and you won't be able to get it, and you won't be to be able to cop it. And think about it like these days, how safe is it really for you to go to another place? And say, yo, I'm a, let me get a bag of this. And actually yeah. trust that what's in that bag is what you're looking for. Yeah. Because my thing is, if I go somewhere hoping that and you can bring me some bush, I'm going to be pissed. You feel me? hmm Listen, yeah. I, I, mm-mm, see, yeah. I can trust going home because I know I'm set oh. forever and ever on top of many things. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Places, I'm like, damn, do I have friends? I'd be like, yo, I know I know somebody that live here. <laughs> For real? That's me too, <laughs> low-key. Hey, I know you, your, your, your grandmother Russian, right? You ain't got no cousins or something? That's what <laughs> I'll be like, yo, um, so and such. And no, I can't. No, nah, certain places or I don't know. I don't know. But also, I'm not interested in going certain places. And I feel like the places I'm not interested in going in are the places that you probably wouldn't be able to find weed. <laughs> no, that also. Because there's a few places I want to go, but it's either for like reasons such as like my sexual orientation and things like that, mm-hmm. <laughs> that I'm just not going to go. And then there's just some places I just don't really... It's I can tell it's not for me. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? It's just... Oh, that's all. Some of them yeah. tough people. If you know mm-hmm. me, I thought, I mean, nah, I don't really <laughs> shape the car, but y'all just different, and I don't want to go over there. And it's going to look cool and dreary. Yes. I, said, I want to go on vacation. I want sunshine. I'm trying to leave here and go somewhere that's going to make me feel great, not dreary. You know what Give I mean? Give me some water. That's what I'm saying. Or something nice with some, you know, some scenery. scenery. Exactly. I like mm-hmm. buildings and famous shit, you know? Mm-hmm. But, All for it. Um. Oh, we didn't talk about Kevin Samuel's passing away because when we recorded, what, what was to talk about? It, <sighs> what to talk about with him. Well, yeah. it wasn't necessarily about him. It's just the fact that, like, when we recorded, it was quote unquote a rumor that he passed away, and his mom was like, "No, he's not dead. Why y'all doing this?" Blah 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 blah. Mm-hmm. I feel like. We might have talked about this before, how, like, desensitized we are about, like, certain things. And I feel like it's fucked up for a parent to find out that their child has passed away via social media. Well, like, I feel like certain things you kind of should, like... Is that what he's known for? <laughs> then what else, what else the hell do you want? I'm not talking about him specifically. I'm speaking in general because there's oh. been other cases, you know, where people don't find out that their loved ones have passed away until they go on social media. But are they like stars? That. 
Oh, is that what makes it different? Actually, I mean, I'm pretty cut and dry and rough with this. Um, the same way everything else comes out for them as quick as possible, TMZ, all these things, is the same way they death going to pop out too. I'm sorry that you were not alerted first, but this is the world that we currently live in. Shit, sick, bro. Something happened to their ass, it's there. Something has, they do this here, it happens. They get arrested, they get this, they just happen to die, and we got it. Mm-hmm. It's up. I gone. hate it for them. That sucks to be log on, and that's what you see. But um, you're also like parents of a celebrity or figure relative. or something. So a lot of things are already not normal. So let's not act like y'all living a normal life and somebody dies and it's like, damn, I didn't, I never heard about that. Mm-hmm. No, that's not how that go. Please. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, get paid, y'all get paged for such life. Okay. Oh I, <laughs> it's okay. Y'all be all right. I don't know. I'm a little rough with it, but I guess, but the fuck. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't know what I'm about to do about people, mom. Um, that sucks. <laughs> I don't know, bitch. <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> you. I hope nobody's not offended. I ain't trying to be nasty or nothing. I'm just saying. I'm dead. What? what? But tell me what the, anything wrong with what I said? Or is it no. delivery? No, it's just the delivery. It's ah. just the delivery. Because, I mean, you're right. It, it's... It's just, I kind of, me personally, though, I kind of feel like a little sensitivity should be had, but they oh, don't care yeah. at the end of the day because, I mean, whoever's going to get the first dollar for, oh, breaking news, Ray Tay Tay, you know what I'm saying, TMZ, The Shade Room, whoever the hell it is. Hear me out. When it's something good that happens, they be the first to call the outlets and sell stories, mm-hmm. right? You're right. So, uh, everybody trying to make that dollar, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Well, sorry, when, mama. When your life, when your life becomes a business, your business. Exactly. I hate that mama had to go on CNN or whatever the fuck she had to go on and see the the thing. That sucks. That's mm-hmm. terrible. But the fact that she was disputing it, though, like I was like, oof, embarrassment. That sucks. Like, girl, you couldn't call somebody and be like, hey, bro, are you sure? Dad? Yeah. Are you sure? Well, maybe like shock and disbelief too. And probably, like I said, he's a uh, social media then. So, and it's very often that they kill off these social media people. They kill Bruh. them off the other week. Okay. Like Ziggy Marley was, was killed off the other day. I don't know if you Excuse thought. Excuse me? No. He got killed off the other day, like like two weeks ago. Yes. So I was like, bitch, who? I was like, ain't no way. <laughs> that don't make no sense. Yeah. And they do it all the time. So I'm sure she was probably like, ah, eh, nah. And maybe she had just maybe recently talked to him and shit like that. So it was kind of like, ain't no way. Okay, this is so off topic, but I don't know why I just thought about this. This is very you. Go ahead. Do you remember the movie with Sinbad called Kazam? Of course I remember Kazam. <laughs> okay. Because if you try to search it, that shit don't exist. Um, It definitely exists. We watched it. Bruh. A few times. Because I'm I'm always pissed off about it. Dog. It pisses me. I love it. I'm about pissed off. Because who the fuck wishes for fucking junk food? Bruh. <laughs> Forget it. This nigga got a room full of junk food. He yep. gets so upset. All of them fries. Oh, Listen. my God. The burger. It was the burger that pissed me off. The burger was the first thing that fell. It was nasty. Piece of tomato. <laughs> it just... What? I like tomatoes, but y'all don't like burgers, so... I like tomatoes, but it's just the way it fell. It was just like... Burp. Yeah, but that shit don't exist online, like at yes, all. It does. Okay, you look it up and you tell me when you send find the link, okay? But You mean the movie itself? Yeah, you can't find anything about it. You can't find the picture, like, okay. it's removed. Somebody said Sinbad paid to have it removed, and I'm like, I, I did not know Sam. you can do that. And then what comes up? Look. That's, isn't that Shazam with Shaq? Or maybe it's Shazam. One of them. One of them don't exist. The one with Sinbad doesn't exist. Is it Shazam, the one oh, with Shaq? Oh, which one is that? Shazam, the other one. Okay, okay. I I got Shazam you. is the one with Sinbad. Oh, my bad, my bad, my bad. Okay. That's my bad. I'm saying the wrong Shazam one. Shazam is the one with Sinbad. Yeah, I was like, girl, I didn't even. Yeah, I've heard about it, but it's like, wasn't it like really bad? It was the same shit like Kazam. It was the same. The Shazam and Kazam were like the same fucking movie. They did the same thing. Okay. Mm-hmm. But like, I was like, 
Yo, money can buy anything, yo, because it's a freaking myth at this point. Like, you know I was thinking about what's in bad what he said. It. I was thinking about First Kid. That's my movie. Oh, wow. <laughs> yes. That was a good movie. I didn't see that it's in a on long Disney time. Plus. It's on Disney Plus. Shout out to you. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, why you come up? Where the hell did that come from? You need three wishes? No. <laughs> No, the something I sent you earlier. The funny you said the something I sent you earlier about the girl talking about she want to do a reading for me. She had a picture. <laughs> I've been through that. I've had somebody done. It. You remember that? Somebody was like, "Oh, I, I've been what? My ancestors have told me that you need. I need you, your ancestors need to tell you to get the fuck out my DM. <laughs> get the fuck <laughs> on with your fucking pipes and business. Talking about your ancestors told you that I need a reading. All right, bitch. I was like, um, girl, what? And she's like promoting this poly life thing or whatever. But where is the picture? Oh my god, the picture. Poly life, poly gang. See it, y'all? Hmm. Oh, it's not gonna go sideways. But that's that's wait a minute. Oops. Oh. That's why I thought about it. Oh, okay, okay. I see. A genie in a bottle. I was like, ma'am. Okay. I can't. I was like, what the hell? Like, why is she bringing up? Shazam, Kazam, whoever. The two of them. So he paid to get it removed? That's what I heard. But I can't find you anything about it to confirm. Flex. Flex did like that was must... actually movie removed ASAP. Oh. <laughs> that <laughs> was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> that he didn't even get that removed. I, to know. I tried to go watch it and I couldn't find it. I was looking for, like, I typed in Michael Jackson on, like, the um search. And so many Michael Jackson movies came up. I found one with some, I don't know who the actor was, but they were talking about how Michael Jackson loved hot sauce and fried chicken and how it was like from the security like guard's point of view. I feel like I've heard that before. It was like Chasing Neverland or Finding Neverland or something like that. I think it was called. Mm-hmm. I don't remember what it was called. But I was like, if y'all talk about this man and his hot sauce one more time. Listen, if it ain't Jackson's The American Dream and if it don't mm. t- seven hours to watch it it ain't true that was such a good movie that's oh always a good movie you just like, think you, okay, honey, you gotta call out from work for that or watch that on the weekend because that you gotta thing. go see the house oh I yeah go yeah, inside i don't know about that they just have rats, nosy. Right? oh shit never mind <laughs> <laughs> what <laughs> i'm not no, where you at gary right yeah gary it's indiana funny, but i like to take, stand outside that's okay. yeah yeah <laughs> And they got all the little plaques. You're funny. The plaque. <laughs> it's been preserved or whatever the hell. I was like, right, no. right. I, um, I started watching a Janet Jackson. Was it a movie or a documentary? I don't remember the documentary, whatever that she did. And I got to the part where she like went back home. Huh? I said I don't think I've watched that. I didn't finish it. I just saw like the first like 20 minutes and there's like a mural they painted on the, um, some wall, not too far from the house. And she got mm-hmm. all emotions. She's like, I didn't know they did this. Oh my gosh. And I was just like, girl, there are murals of y'all all over the fucking world. Are you serious? Like, yeah, but something different about it being in your hometown, in your house that I you guess. grew up in and then seeing like the house that you grew up in and like, damn, like, mm-hmm. Child. she said oh she said she was like it looked so much bigger when i was younger like i remembered it being bigger and i was like yo that's how i felt that's the first time is. bruh the first time i went back to jamaica after i moved here i was like well all the houses look so small oh hell no, no. <laughs> like, uh, well i drove down the street that like i lived on and i was like these houses look way like there's two two-story houses but they still look way smaller yeah, your like, eyes opened up yeah you know, i was a, like a bigger world last so you're like damn yeah. And I myself have gotten bigger, so yeah, as well. Mm-hmm. Now I feel that I feel like in Jamaica, like the house used to be a lot bigger, and now sometimes I'm like, I'm like, damn. Even though it's expanding again, it was just like, damn, like like it's a regular house. Like how the hell we was doing all this? Like, make mm. yeah. do facts. <laughs> like my house, like my parents' house in CT, to me used to be a lot bigger mm-hmm. in my mind. Yeah. But I do feel like it it was big. I just feel like, you know, Jamaicans and they like to pick up and pack up. Mm-hmm. Don't it's I know not, it? You know how it would be over the years. I would have yeah. Extra yeah. dining room table. And what I'm saying. Big. Different stuff. Yeah, but I definitely feel like that shit used to be bigger. But. I'll be wanting to ask, like, where where is this going? You plan on buying the next house? Like, you said it's to Jamaica? Why do we have all of this in here? Please explain. You know, you know, <laughs> things. 
Mm-hmm. Hoard it until God knows when. Will not let it go. My mother trying to dump all her stuff on me since I done moved. I'm like, ma'am, where am I putting it? She's like, you know, you can't find one little. No, mom. No, mom. Yeah. I can't I find no little nothing. To catch it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm-mm. And then be the first to tell us, oh, yeah, I was drunk up. So, hello. Yeah. With all the <laughs> shit you gave me. Like. <laughs> son seriously what else mm-hmm. i want to say um, yeah what else you got to say i had i ain't really had no little uh, um i don't even i'm trying to think if anything really was popping this i mean this last week was kind of like chill right yeah like kind of mm-hmm. chill not too much craziness other than them on them getting locked up and whatever but that was just yeah. like yesterday Today. like yeah. and homeboy that died and whatever Ooh. The guy, the man. Oh, wait. William. Wait, first of all, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. He had a heart attack? I think he he, he died on top of somebody. <laughs> yeah, Viagra fuck. Uh, I oh Jesus. I personally did not do any research or look into this at all because I, they said he he died on top of this girl. Ain't it true that he died, right? Like she asked, she asked her? if she could help him. And he said, oh, my chest and drop down. I'm going to say, this sound like a cover story, but nobody else never did that with you for confirm or deny what is happening. So sound like the Viagra hit and it hit hard. Um, he like women? <clears throat> this is the United States of America. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I don't know what you want me to say. Like, <laughs> I just didn't get like attraction from to woman from him. there's a, there's a lot of i don't get a lot of whatever's in this place but guess what y- yeah so, you're right so it shall be i don't know why i didn't know that he lived in atlanta i should have figured really i should have figured and i just want to be clear that that woman was a cis woman correct <clears throat> hello <laughs> Man, not hello hello hi <laughs> Like I said, I did not do any oh, research into this. It rough, it rough, it rough, it rough bad. <laughs> the possibilities are endless. Whoa. Well, like I said, we are in America. Um, <laughs> hell no. Whatever. I love Atlanta. Hey, let me stop. Yep. Um, what the hell? Woo. <laughs> you funny. Let me see. I don't uh, think. I don't think anything else was popping off this week. I think people was behaving themselves, I guess, for the most part. For the mo- oh, they been in Plan B? Oh, shit. Here we go. Ah, see. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, what are your thoughts considering? <laughs> I mean, me personally, I can't take Plan B no way because apparently it don't work for people over 160 pounds. And me oh, well past that. Say that. <laughs> um... But I mean, like, damn, why y'all trying to force people to have kids? Mm. Like, plan B? That's just like the sperm <laughs> and the egg, nothing to farm yet. That's within 72 hours of conception is when you use plan B. Like, what are we have are we having a shortage of human beings? Is there a shortage of birth? Like, what's what is keeping? I don't know what the hell going on. <laughs> that's that, like, it's not even about the whole abortion thing at this point. It's kind of like what is why are you trying to force people to have kids? Like, what's the end result of all of this? Because all yeah, of what is, things are like leading to something, but what is the big idea? Exactly. Like, where? What's cooking? That's what I want to know. What's cooking? Mm-hmm. Nah, I don't know what the hell is cooking, but I don't. I don't I'm that's- sorry, but I don't. I don't indulge in Plan B because that's <laughs> not my lifestyle, and I don't really have to go about those things. But I do not feel like those things should be touched. Or messed with because <laughs> I feel like they're necessary, mm-hmm. you know, for the hoes that don't learn. But they're necessary. But also, like, plan B, though. Like, yeah. abortion and then now plan B. Like That's what I'm saying. It's something. I don't know. They trying to force you to have these damn babies, boy. Somebody said something about condoms being banned, too. I was like. Y'all never tightened up. Can y'all tighten up now? If y'all never tightened up before, please tighten listen. up. And when I say tighten up, I mean tighten up your front. Close it. Like, tighten up. <laughs> It'll be a sexless summer. <laughs> Damn, it's not even about being be safe with it. I know. And nobody even ever saying like, no, don't have sex because 
that's that, that's not a thing. But it's like, please just tighten up. Um, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Because y'all no, have I, all these options to like. But anything, but anything is happening in law or the government, they always do the opposite. So let's see how this goes. We about to have a fucking baby boom. Oh my god. In the middle of a fucking recession. <laughs> yeah. In a panorama. In a way we go. Yeah, yeah, it's about to be some shit. Maniable. Not available for no fucking baby showers. None of that shit. Because I said, mm. Mm. you heard it here first. <laughs> you heard you're it not, here first. You're not DJing said, no baby showers? I ain't doing that. No, no, no. <laughs> you are funny. <laughs> I'm saying, man. If, you know, I'm not saying people not going to want to have kids and stuff. But, like, for those who don't. But th- just tighten up. Now, this is not even the time for it. Because nobody knows what the fuck they're dealing with right now. Mm-hmm. And shit is looking real bleak. Yeah. But it look like some fuckery coming, so it's better to kind of prepare yourself. Don't even, mm-hmm. don't even add on no extra baggage. I can't manage right now. No, it's not the time at all. That's what I'm saying. Don't add on no extra baggage that you cannot manage right this very second if that's not what you're supposed to be freaking doing and if you're not planning for it or have planned for it. Not the time for surprises at all. Yeah. No surprises but, right now. Because the emergency contraception, as they call it, no, I tried to work with that. Like, no. I just want to thank God, bro. Like, that you're a lesbian? <laughs> the only gayness upon me. Like, <laughs> like, it's crazy. Like, I feel like, you know how, like, a Lion King with Simba, how he put the little thing on his head? Like, I feel like John knew, and he just said, bow, lesbian. Because it's, man. And I know it's not just for, like, that. It, it can be for anything. Like, something happens to a woman, unfortunately, and she needs to take that kind of thing. But I'm... I'm speaking of for those who do it willingly and such. I'm just saying, like, it just sounds like a lot sometimes. I got to say. Because we talked about all that stuff last time. We talked about the birth control. We talked mm-hmm. about all this stuff. It just sounds like so. It made my head spin. I'd be like, bitch, what? You got to do what now? Hell no. Nah. Yeah. I wish y'all luck. <laughs> I don't know, friend. Bless your heart. <laughs> bless your heart. Bless everything. Yeah, bless your heart when you're over there. Sometime. Mm-hmm. Yeah, when they have to play Chinese skip. <laughs> Ch- oh, did you see that video? What video? they had? Um, apparently Chinese skip is worldwide, low key. Like it is Where called you, different things in different countries. Where you been, friend? Under a rock. Mostly so. I don't be yeah, concerned yeah, about myself. Do different kind of thing, and people do it different ways. Yeah. And, yep. Mm, I thought that okay. was so cool. Yeah. I was like, look at us. Mm-hmm. You know, when the white people don't take me from where we come from. What do you guys what do you guys call Chinese skip, I wonder, from different islands? What do different islands call Chinese skip? Oh yeah. I'm, I'm gonna curious. Make a like what does Trinidad that? play Chinese skip? What is like um Barbados or mm-hmm. St. Lucia and etc. Yeah, I wonder. You know where oh. we get Chinese skip from. Listen, where we get China bomb from? Well, that's probably because your eye. Oh, Jesus. Well, I hate you my pull, people. Because you got to pull the hair for the bump? <laughs> Gosh. <laughs> I hope not. <laughs> wow. I get tight. <laughs> <laughs> Possibly for real, because Jamaican's for real. Yeah, that's why okay. I stopped, because I'm, like, I'm not going to finish that statement. <laughs> because it's pulled tight. Yo, that's funny. <laughs> that's racist. Is it? Is I hate them. I hate them so much. Is it, girl? <laughs> is it racist? Some would say some hairstyle can be racist. Well, the name of the hairstyle, but ca- the reason they're calling it that. I got you. No, I feel mm-hmm. you. <laughs> Chinese bump. Mm-hmm. Mm-mm. Okay. What would it call? What? No, but they're not even Chinese bumps. What about Bantu knots? Bantu knots. Uh huh. Well, I'm just hearing about Bantu knots within the last five, After ten years. years of hearing Chinese bumps. I got you. Yeah, exactly. true. Exactly. So true. we don't know where them get it from. Mm-hmm. Well, you but. know, such, you know, um, Chinese or in Jamaica right now. So I'm sure, huh? <clears throat> yes, they do because we let them. Yes. Black, but. People, black people, no, no, the black people do good. Why did we get me started on that? Because that's, that's, that's a whole episode Diet black in folk. itself. I need some of these Zulu warriors is what the hell I need. Not y'all niggas. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Honestly. 
year. Do you have a what you call it this week? A good gal. You know, honestly, <laughs> it was Mother's Day recently. You want to give it to your mom? The ever loving good girl always, my what mother. Listen, yeah. she went to um for Mother's Day. She went to a concert. Who she went to a concert to go? Where she see? went. Um. Oh, you should see the picture. I'm gonna show you the picture she sent me. Is it, it's the art reggae one. Freddie McGregor and Marcia Griffiths. It was what yeah. Was there was a lot of yeah, those art of reggae. Ones. Yeah. Oh, she went to it. The art of reggae one. Look by the picture she sent me. Oh. Yeah. Shoot, I was just looking at it and somebody was there and I was like, oh, da, 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 da. oh man, yeah. yeah. Art of Reggae Music Festival. Talk about some yeah. six more six to four going. I Small was like whole world. Kasha at girl. Period. I was like, miss, with your legs out. I see thigh. What are you? Yes, Mother Judes. That's what we like. Mm-hmm. The original. I can't be a thigh. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, make sure you tell it, yeah. Okay, <laughs> just a little sample. Oh my! You saw the lineup for best of the best in, or no? What Memorial Weekend? No, oh. I just know Barris is on there. I yes, don't. That's the only reason I would go. Then put what's my kind of funny? No, Lolly. Yeah, Lolly. Mom dancing. <laughs> yeah, I did. Lolly slept with yo. Yeah. That shit's crazy. This man came right. From having freaking conflict, exactly from conflicts and body water. Take a break, <laughs> come back and drop tune after tune after tune, and then turn into the new dancing style. Like what the? Fuck? I was like, yo, love to see it. Yeah, man, I take over the stage right there now, and then a whole um, bunch of other people. Let me look and see. I'm never really to remember because for them lineup always make me dizzy. Yeah, it's always a lot going on for their lineup. <laughs> I feel like. And they can never tell you who is what makes me believe y'all get all the y'all get all the leftovers. Whoever oh, no shit. book whoever no book fit um memorial who no get. Who is this? My order done shipped and um we have Berris. We have Christopher Martin. Always. Okay, yeah. Um Tentic. You never know what I'm thinking. Who that? Ten tick. I don't know who that is. The number 10 and T, I can okay. 10 tick. No. Oh, well. Lyrical. Okay. Ricardo Drew. Vagabond. Oh, oh okay. Yeah. Wait, Soka is on Best of the Best Line? Now? Yes, they be doing that. You don't remember last time we had with girl and, oh yeah, Patrice Roberts did it too. Okay, go on. Patrice, Patrice again. again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Pressure. Wow. Still like a love and affection. Imagine. <laughs> Let me see who again. Who is Yaksta? No, 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 people here look like some Ross. No, no, no. Mm-hmm. Um, Mr. Vegas. What? Wow. To do what? Take away and give your hat to Sir, please. Mm-hmm. Lord of mercy. Yes. Let me see. I'm going to eat. Natalie. Sham. Sham. I love Sham. Oh, glory. Okay. That's the lineup. That is it. That's it? I feel like some more people add up on it. That dry. Ten people that. I told you, that's why I don't like their lineup. The only person I used to go for is Barris for real. I never want to go um, for nobody else. And yeah, I forgot N I N I because you know some come out late, late, late. Yeah. Lyrical love for the best artist and Patrice too. You remember the mm-hmm. time we had if we had, it was couple, like couple soccer artists did come uh-huh. out. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah. <sighs> and then La well, Lali did. And then Lali. Lali. Shout out to Lali. 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 Oh, what's on sale? What's on sale? Hey. Mm-hmm. Cocky over there, cocky over there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what's it, you know? Conflicts and body water. Excuse no, me, ma'am. Sir, no, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. <laughs> no, ma'am. <laughs> Excuse me, what? No, ma'am. Mm-mm. All right. So you ain't got no good girl of the week. Well, though, you do it. I said, no, you said, mother, your mother, your mother, your mother. My bad. I yeah. got to do better. What, with your good girls of the week? Mm-hmm. That just means another girl not act good. What y'all gonna do? Yeah, because. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. But, you have plans for Memorial Day? Just SSS Red. Mm hmm. Okay. Memorial Monday. Mm hmm. That's the only thing I can say I see for that because I'm not really. 
Early suicide. People be safe. Another holiday coming up. Yes. Give it a rest. Please. Please. Just give it a rest. Y'all going to Miami? Please don't. Uh, what girl? You gonna stop these people from going to Miami? Oh shoot! Wait a minute. It's the beginning of May. All you lesbians that's heading down the Sweet Heat and um, oh, all the other shit, y'all be safe, okay? Mm-hmm. Y'all be safe. Um, make sure y'all all got your own. Damn, we should have discussed etiquette, but it's okay. Oh, we okay. we got ten minutes. <laughs> ten minutes. Okay, so some etiquette when y'all going on these trips, Sweet Heat, Magic City Fest, whatever you call them, shit, all everything. <laughs> Um, please make sure you have your own money to, um, book your accommodations, get your food, um, any little shopping, little things you want to do. Cause we all know when you go on these things, you go to turn up, correct? You go to transportation. Group. Yes. You go to act the fuck up with your friends, turn up. Y'all go to the strip clubs. Y'all throw the money, all of that shit. And I need y'all to be prepared because I remember I heard about people sleeping on the beach. Okay. Yeah. Because then they have no damn room. Mm-hmm. Okay. Or because, pay. or because you booked a room with fifteen other people and everybody are fucking y'all for leave because you're not like those facts. But niggas be- actually getting dropped off with their bags on the beach, hanging out all day with their shit on fucking South Beach, and then nighttime come they ain't got nowhere to sleep. You try to go bag you a shorty so you can spend the night in her. You can room. spend the night. Y'all are tacky as fuck. Like etiquette, don't do that. Don't do that. And so y'all like young baby dykes or whatever we got on here. Please don't do that. The gabies, don't do that. Like, go prepare. Like, don't be stupid. Yeah, and I mean, that shit happens every year. You're not missing nothing. Get your money up if you got to go next year and miss this one. Like, honestly, first of all, like... You know how many sweet heats I had to miss and wanted to go until I could finally make it to that shit? <laughs> I've been wanting to go for a while, son. Yeah. Since, like, the first one, bro. And the diner and all them stuff. And please, mm-hmm. when you go, we just talking about, the, talking about these drugs and stuff. If you go in places and you know you're trying to, oh, yo, I need some of this, this, and this, please know where you're getting your stuff from, yo, because the way this, you know what I'm talking about, that big F, been running oh, around, and y'all just, just be safe. I don't For those know. that don't know what she's talking about, fentanyl, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Y'all don't know what people are putting in their shit. You don't know what they spraying their shit with. You don't know Nothing. what they're mixing it with. If you're doing other drugs, you don't know what they're cutting it with. Like that's what I'm saying. Y'all Stop need to be going safe. to club and sharing blunts and all that. Like oh. what are y'all doing? Y'all just be sharing your mouth. First of all, it, I don't care what nobody say. We still in low key a pandemonium, so y'all should not be sharing blunts with nobody. Also, you go to Miami, they be smoking dirties down there. If you don't do cocaine, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. You about to be nice and um, you know. Different kind of high. That's what I'm saying. Never so, be the same. J- honestly. So, honestly, like, just not even trying to be no party poopers or, oh, my God, y'all old, blah, blah, blah. I know. Oh, like, oh, but I'm alive. I like <laughs> And I have lived and I've had fun. <laughs> just be responsible. And ain't nobody never drug me. So. Listen, that part. Get to it. Like, me no. knock on wood. <laughs> yeah, but my thing, but you already know, I don't, listen, yeah. I do, I don't do certain kind of drugs in the first place. Mm-hmm. Okay, and I just don't be getting my shit from her. This is why I make it a note. If I know you from somewhere and I know I'm going there, I try to make a point to link up with you and get my stuff. I'm mm-hmm. pretty good right now. Like I, all the states, I'm kind of filling up my states one by one <laughs> <laughs> with people I know I can hit up. Like, hey, yo, I need da 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 da. If I'm in the city or whatever, I'm in your town or whatever. I need to get a few more people, and we we good, we global, <laughs> resourceful. Okay, you think know, like. See, I'm trying to be big, good, but I go to the UK and shit like that. Well, I already am, but that's. Good. I was about to say, I got you if you need to go there. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. I'm good on that. I'm good there. <laughs> I be so good hook up. I'm trying to get some like some African shit. Like when I go over there, but how do, is that okay? Is that okay? See, I don't know. Wait a minute. Which part of Africa? See, that's that shit again. Mm-hmm. We ain't trying to end up in nobody jail doing you nothing. Feel me? I can't even see. But you ever heard of any cases like that though? I don't think I ever had. Like in Africa, like, no. Or something like that. It's mostly the um the, the white places. You know what? I know I can go to Africa and get, get bomb of some shrooms. Yo. Oh my gosh. Probably some shit that had bring me right to my ancestors. Okay, like oh. hey, hey. <laughs> Son. Bruh. Listen, Mm-mm. oh man, I am not playing with you. Nope. 
<laughs> but yeah, everybody be safe. That's yeah, it. That's the bottom line. Be safe. And if you come with people, leave with them same people. That, Don't that. leave your friends somewhere because they met some nigga. No, exchange you numbers know. and y'all can see each other in the daytime. You Don't know they're <laughs> They be living there with you. They be like, oops, bitch, gotta go. And they be leaving their friends. They don't care. They leave their friends all the time. And they, f- like, oh, mm. They're friends. Sorry. I oh, be, okay. Yeah, come on and say, like, I know my friends' moms. I'm not trying to deal with y'all mama if y'all go missing. So let bring me, your ass me, back to the let room. Let me tell you how your mama ain't calling me about Nathan. Because I'm going to be like, hell no. Nah, no, she you, not calling me. Uh-uh. No, I don't know. Your mother or brother start looking out for me. I ain't got time for it. Imagine okay. your sister call my phone. Oh, girl. Oh, girl. Listen, you don't want my sister calling your phone. So, um... <laughs> for real? I'm gonna be like, huh? She gonna be like, hell no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, so, I mean... If anything, y'all go back to the room together. If they decide to leave out after that, that's, you know... I mean, share your locations with each other. Turn on your location. If you got, like... There's so many ways that y'all can be safe and like be cautious without being just sitting in the house. Like just it's not even that, that you have. Go fucking go places. And it's like they completely forget. They focus so much on the fun and turning up. Okay, that's great. That's what we claim to do. However, do this shit responsibly. They don't care. They come, they get way too drunk. First of all, there's a certain amount, of, there's a certain level of drunk. I don't get outside. I am, never. I am not in my like house, my, my place. I'm not getting a certain level of drunk because I need to be seeing what the hell going on. People be effing floppy. With at least one person who I know for sure question uh, without a question got me. This is what I'm saying. People just be out. They be like, hey, okay, well, she over there. She passed out over here. You over here somewhere with somebody else. Next thing you know, your friend got drugged or you got drugged uh-huh. or something like that. Y'all wake up the next morning. Y'all don't even know what the hell going on. Like, We went to, what was it, Light Glue? I think, was it Halloween? I think it might have been Halloween. We went to Light Glue. Mm-hmm. And this girl, when I tell you this girl was drunk, couldn't mm-hmm. even walk. Her friends are literally carrying her, like about three or four. Then one of them dropped the girl and Troy and I back. I care. I was like, I, that's scary to me. Like me being the part. Like no man. Mm-mm. Hold on, hold on, hold on, friend. Now this. <laughs> Let's take it back. Hold on. I do recall the time we were out. <laughs> <laughs> And somebody, no names need to be said, somebody got really, really super, super shit face. <laughs> and we had to walk that bit to the car because we wasn't done partying. Um, <laughs> and we locked that ass in the car because, because I think it was inconvenient. Like, you were like that one person who was drunk as hell, mad early, and we were like, no, like... <laughs> What a time to be, to be alive. alive. Because oh I swear, every time we used to go to a damn place, there was always something going on. Every yeah. time we went to the hangar, there was something going on. Mm-hmm. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I bet you just reminded me of that. I really was. Well, like, I'm just car. saying, like, like, <laughs> that I, it was like, okay, to put somebody in a car for them to sleep it off. But we locked them in the car, though. They this didn't have the key. True. We had this the key. True. We locked them in the car. <laughs> This is very true. Yeah, in the back seat, go on go sleep. Shit. I think y'all need to stop acting like y'all so frightened to meet people and see people that y'all just leave y'all friends behind. Like, oh, yeah, oh, oh, I'm linking up with someone such person. Then you end up back. Like, what happened to your friend, sis? Mm-mm. What happened to your friend? No, you're fine, man. Yeah, they ain't got hoes be ditzy or shit anyway. I don't know. Mm. Yeah, can't relate. Anyways, do better, be better. Uh, <laughs> take care of each other and all these fun things. And make sure you okay, Jerry. <laughs> okay, Jerry. <laughs> um, because we not say and each other. Yes. Uh, <laughs> What's <laughs> good <that>? advice? <laughs> <laughs> um, make sure you follow us on all the social media things. Lion Young V on Twitter. Twitter. M sugar underscore on Instagram. Yeah, I know by now. Pointless yeah. talks on everything. everything. And you know, just like everything else we do over here on the pointless talks and things. Mm-hmm. Whether you got here on purpose or by fate, thank you all so much for listening to this episode of Pointless Talks. Good night. Bye. Good night. Mm-hmm.